Welcome back to Theme Journals. I'm April and tonight we are going to be working on the sewing portion of these envelopes. Now when I one of my first um, envelopes or one of my first videos I did was me sewing envelopes for fall uh, for my fall writing boards and now we're going to be working on the summer writing boards. Um, the fall ones I didn't sew all the way around like I'm going to do on these um, because the backings on the fall ones look better than this. Um, I don't know if you can see it, but it has a lot of bubbles. The, this, oh, I'm sorry. Let's see if I can show you. This is a bubble. So all around it is glued, but this one spot had a bubble and the fabric is not adhered to the napkin. So to seal that off, I'm going to go ahead and sew. Now I've already chosen a golden thread that's like this color right here. And it matches both the this napkin and the other napkin I have. Which is this one. So you can see both colors are present in both napkins. So I'm going to go ahead and use that one. Um, one color for both sets of napkins. All right, and I'm not going to talk um, after this, so I can speed it up and you uh, and it'll be a shorter version of the video. All right, you all have a lovely evening now. Oh, before I you know, sign off completely, I think I'm going to go ahead and reveal what I'm doing. I'm going to do a straight stitch number one. And I'm going to leave it at the default setting. When you do the pinking shears, you don't need to do the um, zigzag stitch. All right. Well, now you all have a good evening.
sorry about that. I just wanted to show you that you have to cut off these little pieces. You don't want any little hangings on or um, certain things I don't mind having the sewing tags on, but this is not one of them. Okay, so you can see that it went all the way around. And the reason <clears throat> uh, behind sewing it all the way around instead of just in certain spaces after I put the folded up for the f envelope is because after I pinked it here, some of the napkin was coming up from the, um, what do you call it? The uh, fabric. So sewing it all the way around will take care of any pieces that are trying to come apart and keep them together forevermore.